Those slick technologies seen in television crime shows such as CSI are no longer science fiction. Crime Scene Forensics investigator ESR is developing and using new devices which will transform DNA analysis and police work. Renee Graham got an exclusive look. The world of forensic crime fighting is getting more and more high-tech and New Zealand research scientists with ESR are at the cutting edge of developments. The combination of technologies is going to result in a large leap forward. For three years they've been working with police on mobile DNA testing laboratories for immediate analysis and databank searches and unmanned aerial vehicles with thermal imaging cameras to map scenes and identify bodies, debris or weapons. ESR aims to process evidence at a crime scene at a much faster rate, so new technologies like this LED device allows them to find trace evidence on the spot, like footprints, blood and fibres. None would be visible without the special light. If you catch a, uh, an offender earlier, then potentially you're, you're um, reducing victimisation immediately because potentially the person could have gone out and continued offending. Live video technology means police can talk directly to scientists at the lab and transmit evidence. Can you see the cartridge cases? ESR is also improving 3D software that gives jurors detailed virtual tours of a crime scene. Academy Award winning former Weta Workshop wizard Seb Marino is leading that work on graphics so realistic they'll be like a photo. They could zoom in, they could pull up information like blood spatter analysis, um, DNA samples, all sorts of, any, any sort of information that was deemed relevant. To ESR says the technologies oh, okay. it's but developing it's here have the potential to help crime Critical fighting elsewhere in the world. Renee Graham, One News.